Hey guys, if you are charging your Tesla Model Y and it's really cold outside, something to keep in mind is that it will take quite a bit of time before it actually starts uh, adding um, energy into the battery because uh, at cold temperatures like this, minus 20 today, um, I just noticed that I've been at the charger for 20 minutes and, and this public charger Vierta public charger here in Finland is saying that it has given out four kilowatt hours of battery uh, power and I have added zero kilowatt hours of power so at 11 kilowatt uh, charging power this is 16 amperes in three phases at 230 volts and uh, with 20 minutes it's kind of it has just heated the car so of course at this cold temperature I, I started charging with the car fully um, cold and the batteries were cold so it used a lot of power for heating the batteries and now that um, information here that it's heating the batteries has gone and also the cabin starts to be quite warm I, I set it on high um, because I was actually quite cold in the car and I, I think uh, now this actually will start soon showing battery added and the percentage will start going up and it was around five hours in the beginning to the limit of 80 percent and now it's at four hours and 20 minutes so if I would leave the car here the charging speed would be quite normal but this is just something to keep in mind if uh, you are charging your car, uh, for example, using something like Crit IO and you're using the cheap hours. And uh, if you have a charging limit which will cut the charging in between and it's this cold outside, that means that it will need to reheat the battery and you are actually wasting power. If, if this video was helpful to you, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.